All right. Before we get any further here, doing a lot of research on the Neko company and Neko wafers, you come across people that comment on websites, so on and so forth when you're looking for things. And I've been seeing a lot of online amateur comedy hour stand-up acts. They have these jokes that they like to make at the Neko wafers. The poor Neko wafers, they've been through enough. They've been through a civil war, two world wars, bankruptcy, being rebirthed. And then, you know, you got amateur hour online people telling jokes about the Neko wafers. You know, what what did they ever do, you know? But anyways, people have said about the Neko wafers in jest, dissing the Neko wafer. What have they said? They have said, all right, all right. So get this. Here's some jokes for you, all right? They taste like chalk. If we ever run out of chalk, we could use Neko wafers. <laughs> oh, man. That's a knee slapper. Or get this. It's like eating plaster. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to tell nobody that joke. <laughs> oh, man. You like that one? No? <laughs> I know. Or one more. Flavors are cinnamon and clove? More like nope and nope. <laughs> <laughs> you get it? So anyways, yeah, uh, a lot of people think uh, they're they're funny with their jokes, dissing the neck away for about them being chalky. Has it ever occurred to you that maybe the powder on these Neko wafers are there so that they don't stick to each other when they're being made in the factory? No, people don't think. I have never tried these Neko.